Hey everyone, here's Rick Vio on Alpha Tape Feed, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use some of the samples that you can find in the new Tape Feed sample pack in different creative ways. To begin with, I've already created a drum rack here with different one shot sounds. We have a normal kick sound without any processing. We created a little bit of extra rumble by looping and filtering top frequencies of this other kick sound. And then we also have some hats uh, that have been slightly processed, maybe reversed, or we add a little bit of effects. Awesome, now let's add some snare sounds. So we head over to the snare one shot folder. And let's produce some of these sounds. And I'm gonna go straight to the number 14. As I really like this one. Let's place it into the drum rack and let's try to be creative with it. So first of all, I'm gonna put some notes in, classic two and four. I'm gonna warp it, and I'm gonna use the beat mode, but the loop mode of the transient would be a single and then we're going to switch here the transient mode to 16th note so that when we decrease the envelope length we start to get some glitches and also we can stretch the sound awesome then we can add another snare sound but also let's try to be creative Awesome, let's use this one here. Great, and I'm going to reverse it and just use a little bit of the tail. Let's record something in. Awesome. Let's quantize it quick. And let's have some effects. Maybe a frequency shifter. And a delay to make it techno straight away. Awesome, so we have a good foundation here. Let's uh, start building something else. And perhaps it would be nice to put some lead sound. So let's go back into the sample pack folder and there's some modular lead loops over here. Awesome, um, let's use this loop here. However, I'm gonna place it into a simpler and we're going to slice it up so that we can play the different, some different sounds uh, in a different way. And I'm also going to put an ARP here to play the instrument. Let's find different slices. This one could work. Right here. There's loads of interesting stuff there.
awesome. Also, let's try to add some effects to also announce what we have over here. So we can start by adding a chorus. Then an amp. And an echo. play with the filter a little bit uh, perhaps when we start arranging everything let's write this down kind of like these lices here Awesome. Then we can, let's add one last thing. So here in the effects folder, we have one siren effect in C. And also we can make use of the character of the sound to create perhaps a pad sound. Can loop it. Add a little bit of fade. Maybe let's add a reverb quickly and a little bit of saturation Awesome, so we have a good foundation here to start a new track. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you'd like to get the pack, please head over to the Sample Sound website. Thank you all for watching, and see you all around soon.